are sorry, the number you have dialed is not in service at this time. Fuzz Pie Guy here. I'm going to show you how to create shortcuts uh, on iTerm2 terminal software for a Mac OS. Now, I like using this uh, terminal on my Mac because we can open up multiple windows within a window, like such, and we can have two here. So we can just close this guy and get back to this one. But other than typing all the commands that we normally use on a Pi or any other type of uh, Linux software or whatnot, we can create shortcuts. So if we want to make a shortcut for the update, we can. So other than typing it in manually, we could just uh, type a shortcut in on the keyboard and it'll run it. So to do that we're going to go up here and click on iTerm2 preferences then we need to click on keys then down here we have a plus minus so we can get rid of that one and we can add and delete whatever we have here so we can just click on plus now I deleted that one, so you, obviously that one you won't see, but anyway. Now we need to click on this and create, type in what we want to do. So I'm just going to do the equal sign. Down here we need to scroll down until we get to send text so here's where we can type in our command so <clears throat> if we click OK and we go back here and we type that in our equal sign it populates it but it don't hit enter which you know we want it to hit enter so let's go back and what we can do is open this up and we need to do a backslash n n as in nancy click ok and now if we click our shortcut key it will run the command so what we can do is go back in here again create another one And let's say we just want to do the minus sign, dash. Then we can go down here, send text. And let's say we want to install git, since that's a command that a lot of people use. So now we can go here. Oh, I forgot to click put the uh, back and then in so now if we click that it's going to install git if it's not installed so hopefully this kind of helps out uh, it will definitely save some time especially if you got a key a macro keyboard or whatnot that would work out really well so uh, hopefully this helped out thanks for watching stay tuned for another one